This morning I signed as well in coordination with Supervisor Barger being in touch with me, a declaration of local emergency for the city of Los Angeles. The city of Los Angeles declared a local state of emergency due to the coronavirus. So your Los Angeles City Fire Department would like to let you know what we are doing about it. We're gonna discuss three different topics. First is the internal LAFD member notification and our coronavirus policies. The second is the external or the public notifications that we've done. And third is the practical application on how you can stay safe. So first, regarding our internal notifications to LAFD members, our firefighters remain on the front lines of safeguarding our communities and we are actively working to ensure that they are well informed and we're taking new steps to ensure safety. We've actually sent multiple internal bulletins educating our members about the signs and the symptoms of the coronavirus. And we've created some easy to follow flow charts of the procedures to take and what personal protective equipment to wear when coming in contact with a possible coronavirus patient. We've also instructed our 911 dispatchers to screen callers who complain of flu-like symptoms about their recent travel locations. If the patient meets this dispatched screening criteria, then the comment, suspected coronavirus patient, Don PPEs, will appear on the incident information for the responding firefighters, and then we're gonna dispatch a medical captain to the incident to uh, provide some guidance in reference to patient destination. We've also provided detailed instructions to our ambulance drivers that before they enter the driver's compartment that the driver should remove and dispose of their PPE in a hazardous waste red bag and perform some hand hygiene to avoid soiling the compartment area. And we've even provided some best practices about uh, vehicle ventilation and the exhaust fans and how to move them to minimize the spread of germs in an ambulance. Additionally, we established specific instructions for the decontamination of our ambulances, our equipment, our PPE, after transporting a suspected or confirmed patient. And regarding patients that might have flown into the LAX airport, our members have been instructed to have a face-to-face -face communication with CDC members to discuss the concerns and to take proper precautions, including patient transportation destination. We've also created protocols if one of our members were exposed for situations where PPEs were not donned prior to patient contact. And the second topic is our external public messaging. So we did create online content that could be found at lafd.org. Just click on the news button along with social media posts, and we continue to share messaging from the Emergency Management Department, the Center for Disease Control, and LA County Health, including non-English speaking messaging. Additionally, we created a proactive video on social media in the month of January when the coronavirus was an early concern, and we showed the extra precautions our members take when coming in contact with a suspected patient and how that we ensure safety for the public. Additionally, we will continue to inform the news media and handle interview requests on the topic. Now our third and final topic is public recommendations. So we want people to avoid close contact with individuals that are sick, avoid touching your eyes, your nose, your mouth. Simply stay at home when you're sick, cover your cough and your sneeze with the tissue and then throw that tissue into the trash. Clean and disinfect frequently touched objects and surfaces. And follow the CDC's recommendations for using a face mask. Wash your hands often with soap and water for at least 20 seconds. And lastly, and perhaps one of the more difficult tasks to perform, is to keep your distance from one another in public settings and to use verbal salutations in place of handshakes and hugs. So we hope this information about the coronavirus and what your Los Angeles City Fire Department is actively doing about it was helpful.